Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me today for these moments of devotion with our Good Shepherd, Jesus. I read from Matthew chapter 25, verse 5 and verse 13. The bridegroom was a long time in coming. Therefore keep watch, because you do not know the day or the hour. Worth waiting for. Sometimes people will wait, and wait, and wait. The hosts of a new show described how people waited for hours in the rain because they heard a rumor that a famous entertainer would give a surprise concert that night. Another host told of a time he had been in an amusement park when a ride was delayed because of mechanical problems. Even though the people in line knew it could take hours to fix, not one person moved out of the line. We stand in long lines on Black Friday, waiting to get that one special gift before it's sold out. Sometimes during Advent, we forget that people will wait. We think we must build anticipation to get people ready for Christmas. We fear that without it, many will be unprepared, like the unwise maidens in Jesus' parable. But the long lines of people who greet the release of the latest smartphone remind us that people will wait if the promise is good enough. How much more we should anticipate the coming of God's kingdom. Jesus compares the kingdom to a wedding feast, a great banquet, or the return of a king. When Jesus comes again, our deepest hopes will be realized and our greatest sorrows will be eased. What's more, God has shown us this in the life of Jesus and allows us to taste the joy of his kingdom even now. But do we grow tired of waiting? Do our spiritual feet hurt as our impatience for Jesus' promises increases? Do we grow impatient waiting for God's answers to our prayers? Unfortunately, many have grown tired of waiting for Jesus. They've abandoned their place in line for quicker returns. Satan has tricked them into thinking that Jesus isn't worth the wait. But, oh, he is. People will wait for hours on the strength of a mere rumor. But our waiting for Christ is based on much more. Jesus has come, and he will come again. We pray. Almighty God, assure us that your kingdom is worth waiting for, and help us to be ready for your coming again. Amen. Well, everyone, may this day help you stay waiting and ready for Jesus' return.